Making music, traveling all over the world, doing all kind of things, you know. It's 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 some some parts not fun, but it's been a lot of fun. The last time I came here it wasn't it was not the way I wanted it to be. You know, but this time it's up full and right because we came in with enough time for people to know that we are here and the show is going on. That's a good vibe. I love it. And I also love Kenya. I love Nairobi. You know that. Yeah, man. For real. It was in church the other day. How was it? Oh, it was cool. It was cool. It's different from the way they treat people when you go to church back in the, in the U.S. or back home. They, they, they expect for you to be all and 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 that, that's a different vibe. The songs that they love and the songs that they want to hear, it's real. I love that. It's different. It's diff It's diff much different than what I'm used to. But I really love that. People can appreciate songs. We make music for everyone. For everyone to, to full joy. I don't say enjoy, I say full joy. We make music for everyone to full joy. And um, clean music that can be played anywhere. And Pastor Ben realized that. So that's why I was there giving up myself. Yeah, man. <clears throat> Richards, um, from the times you started uh, making music, what did you cover? Back in the days, we used to stay, stay, always stay on the positive. Nowadays, I see people making music that um, not everyone can listen to. Because some people get offended when you hear certain lyrics. You know, I and, and I would I would encourage anyone, any young one or anyone coming into the business, if you want to live long and stay strong, make music that everyone can enjoy. See me? The, the, we call that timeless music, music that you could pick it up fifty years later, play it, and it's still good, and every, now nobody get offended. The, 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 the changes I've seen nowadays is like. Um, Say for instance, some people would would venture into dancehall, and um, dancehall back in the days was 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 just a, just a, a place where they where people go to dance, but they, they called it the genre dancehall. It's just the youths um, actually expressing themselves, but express yourself express yourself in a good, positive way where people can you know enjoy themselves, uplift themselves, and and be educated. Just expect to come and enjoy yourself musically, get a musical blessing, you know, because I have a, I have a large um, catalog of music and I know, I know and I really love that the fact that people in Africa really appreciate my music, not just, not just in Kenya, in Africa and, and I, I, I am very, you know, in here that people really appreciate the music that I give and I'm looking forward to performing for them all the time. And you know what I get? That's even better than money. The smiles on their faces. That makes me feel so good. Singing with you. And the fact that they know the words of my song and they actually sing with me. That's it. That, oh, that's awesome. More than money. I, yeah. For real. <laughs> Yeah, I want to look forward to it, you know. Yeah, thank you for the compliment. Um, you know, I've been doing it for years, and uh, what really drives me, uh, and the, the, the reason why I started bringing artists over here, is because of my late brother, Pupa Davis, you know. He was very instrumental in my life and the life of others. Whenever you do something, you used to, you know, we used to, like, help children's home, so when he passed on, I decided to keep on with his legacy. That's the, that's the force that really drives me to keep bringing in artists, you know, in, 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 his, in his memory, you know. Mm. And as you said, Busy Signal, I brought Busy Signal here in, in 2017. It was here already in 2017, you know. And as you know, Kenya, mostly they like the foundation artists. They like the one music that at least, you know, will educate them and, you know, they can learn from. You know, that's why I have to bring people like Black like Glenn and, and so on. Yeah, there are a lot of uh, room in Vago too in 2016. So that means, you know, I just keep mixing, you know, mix and match, you know. But at least the force that drive me is my brother, Papa Davis, 
May he, may he keep racing in peace. Oh, Beulah Land, sweet Beulah Land, that's where I want to be. My mother's land, my father's land. I saw a vision of a Rasta man beckoning out to me. He said, gather your brothers and sisters from the dark corners of the earth. And if they're living in America, or even in my homeland, Jamaica, the brothers in the Southwest in South Africa, even in Australia down and there, tell all the Buffalo soldiers, prepare themselves for war. Cause when united we're stronger, divided we will fall. And when the runnings get steeper, my love for Jah it gets deeper. Jah Jah is my guiding savior. I will sing out His praises forever. Oh Kenya land, sweet Kenya land, that's where I'll always be. My motherland, my father's land. Sin, Rastafari. What a pleasant it's been since you opened your light and let me in. Now no matter how jealous people try, I'm gonna love it every day I die. And if this feeling you have should... Uh, for the launch of the Perak Pamoja Festival series, um, thank you for coming. Um, it's we are doing this because uh, Perak we are now 20 years old this year, and we decided we have to reach out to our members and our customers down on the ground in the cities. This uh, series will constitute Nakuru, Nairobi, Mombasa, and Kisumu. Um, we are starting with uh, Nakuru. Um, this will involve with the uh, Hospitality Expo during the day. We'll have a family fun day as well during the day. Then we have a Sherehe Zone, uh, which will be going until dawn. Um, we are starting with Nakuru on the 20th of October. That is uh, Mashuja Day, which is the next week on Sunday. Um, we'll have road shows all throughout next week. Um, we'll have some CSR things happening. We'll be planting trees, visiting children's homes in Nakuru County over the week um, to make uh, to leave some sort of impact on the community in Nakuru. Um, for Nakuru, we've said we have to start with a bang, and that bang is a uh, international artist known as Mr. Glenn Washington with the State of Emergency Band. As you can see, he's graced us with his presence here today. Um, thank you, and we really need to make sure uh, we welcome him. Uh, I know he's been, we've seen him around town, just finding out what Nairobi looks like. He'll be visiting a couple of uh, towns during the next week uh, before his performances next weekend. One will be in Nairobi, then they will be gracing us in Nakuru for what I think will be the greatest show of this year. As it will have, uh, we'll start with some local Nakuru artists. As you know, the clamor for Built Kenya. Where you go, you start with the locals. So we'll have our local Nakuru artists, including some good reggae artists. We'll have some uh, Kenyan artists. Um, then we'll have uh, the big experience of the day, which will be Mr. Glenn Washington. And uh, we invite you please to Nakuru, Tembea Kenya, Tembea Nakuru, and as we have a, um, a great, great, great day. On this day, Friday, this great Friday morning, um, we're here 